Good day, basketball fans, and welcome to Settling the Score, powered by Rick Sona. It won't let you down. I'm TJ Manotok, and today we'll be joined by Migs Busos to discuss a very important question, Migs. At itong uh, pag-uusapan natin, isa sa mga tanong na marami na nagtatanong, uh -huh. and a lot of kids are talking about it. Can LeBron James become the GOAT or the greatest of all time? At ikaw, Migs, pinag-iisipan mo mga ba recently kung kaya nga ba ni LeBron? Tingin ko kaya naman, TJ, pero kailangan siguro munang mag-retire muna si LeBron para okay. makita nga natin kung talaga bang deserving siya sa GOAT honors. So, we can finally answer that when the career is done. But yes. we'll talk about now if he's on his way. Can yeah. he get there? So, isa sa mga titig na natin dyan, Migs, syempre, ay yung comparisons dun sa... Tin tinatawag ng GOAT. One, mm. of course, is Michael Jordan, which mm. for most people is already the GOAT. And then, there are the Kobe Bryant fans out there for people who see him as the guy who's closest to Michael Jordan. Kung ikukumpar natin yung number si Lebron kay Kobe at kay Michael Jordan, can he get there? He can get there okay. indeed because right now, he's averaging around 27.1 points per game, okay. 7 rebounds and 7 assists, way better than Michael Jordan and Kobe. Career numbers, yeah. Career numbers. Ah, kasi okay. si, 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 si Kobe, ano lang siya, tagayin ko, di ko ko, four, four rebounds, mm -hmm. si MJ naman, six rebounds. Malayo. Game. Malayo. In terms of all-around All-around, yes, oh, yes. Okay. Kung sasa pag-uusapan. Right, right. For you ba, importante yun na when you're talking about a greatest player of all time, hindi lang great as a point guard or as a shooting guard, kung kaya niya lahat, di lahatin niya? Yes, uh, tingin ko importante rin dyan yung pagiging MVP. Yung okay. gano'ng kaka-valuable sa isang team. Right, And I okay. think LeBron has really done that for, mm -hmm. you know, para sa Miami Heat, para sa Cleveland Cavaliers. Mm -hmm. Same way that Jordan did for uh, for the Bulls and Kobe for the Lakers. All right. Now, you talked about the numbers, the averages. Uh, the, in this day and age, lalo sa mga stat geeks dyan, importante yung efficiency. Yes. Kung gaano ka husay, shumot. Hindi lang yung dami ng shoot at puntos, pero kung gaano ka ka-efficient. And when you talk about efficiency, Right now, this postseason, LeBron is having some mind-boggling efficiency numbers. Para sa yo, is that helping his cause in terms of getting to that discussion? Na pwedeng asya maging goat. Yes, it is, Tij. Because, sure, you have to make, you know, you have to make the shots or you have to be efficient when the game matters. Yon, okay. Yes, uh, especially like uh, with LeBron right now, he's averaging 55%. In Mabe. this playoffs pa lang, okay. at hindi pa siya natatalo. Right, yeah. And uh, way better also than uh, MJ and Kobe. Okay. In fact, there's some people who are comparing his stats now to a combination of a Shaquille O'Neal and a Steph Curry oh. in terms of points in the paint and the field goals in the paint and field goals from three. Mm -hmm. Pag yun ang nakikita mo, lalo ka bang nawiwindang na parang, ang pa nito? <laughs> is, is he that good, really? Kasi si Shaq, kung titingnan mo, sentro. Tapos si, eh. si, si Stephen Curry, point guard. Uh -huh. So, kung paggigitnain mo, siya yung pinaka-middle nga of mm -hmm. all that. And uh, I just don't have the numbers right now for Shaq and Steph combined. Pero I think it's around 66%. Na hinihigitan niya yung kay Sha sa points in the, in the paint. paint. Oh, uh, percent in the paint. And in kay Steph na 46% sa tres. He's above that too, na 47% siya ngayon. Mm -hmm. That's just in one human being, yep. mm -hmm. he can do both? Well, uh, because of these stats, no? Siyempre, it's just a basis. Pero okay. importante pa rin, if you get to win those games, mm -hmm. and LeBron right now, I think this is his sixth, right. or is going on his seventh year, mm -hmm. if everyone mag-final sila. And that's like, right. nobody can really do that. Yeah. Parang the last time somebody did that was uh, Bill Russell, the mm -hmm. Celtics. Although mm -hmm. he won as well. Okay, last yep. but not the least, what would he need to accomplish that, to surpass Michael Jordan and Kobe? Yung Sing Sing. Yes. Pinag-uusapan yung the amount of rings. Is mm -hmm. that key for you? It is a key. Okay. Kasi syempre, stats are all stats and mm -hmm. dyan eh. Pero kailangan niyang manalo ng siguro five or maybe six. Para at least five. Ah, at okay. least five. Okay, so okay. at least to get in that uh, kind of discussion. Well, he only has three for now. But who knows, he could get number four this season. Yes. So we will find out mm -hmm. as we all bear witness to his path to possibly becoming the greatest of all time. Okay, hanggang dito lang po kami ni Mix Bustos and we want to invite you to join the discussion as well. Join us on social media, on Facebook, and on Twitter. Throw in your suggestions, your comments. Kung galit kayo kay Mix sa akin, okay lang yun. Tanggap namin yun. Pero makisali kayo sa discussion. Can the king dethrone his airness and become the goat? So far, ang poll ng Rigsona, yes, says 48%. Okay. Ang no, 52%. Close match. Napakadikit niyan. Mali mo mag-swing pa yan pag kayo sumali a discussion. So, that's it for now. We'll see you again tomorrow or for the next time for Setting the Score, powered by Rick Sona. It won't let you down. Hi guys! Keep watching The Score for the latest sports updates and don't forget to subscribe to the ABS-CBN Sports in Action YouTube channel.